Naomi Osaka versus Victoria Azarenka is the final of the women's event for Cincinnati in 2020. Osaka's had a tough road to the final so far with a couple of three set matches, but also a couple of big wins in her other matches. After a first round bye, she had to beat Machova in three sets after losing the first set 6-7, 6-4, 6-2. In her third round, she had to go up against Yastremska, the number 16 seed, and she looked very impressive beating her 6-3, 6-1. In the quarterfinals, another seeded player, Kontovit, the number 12 seed. Osaka again had to come from a set down, winning it in three, 4-6, 6-2, 7-5. And in the semi-finals against her toughest opponent yet, Elise Mertens, the number 14 seed, Osaka looked even more impressive, winning this one in straight sets, 6-2, 7-6. Azarenka is unseeded in this tournament and had to play all her rounds. Her first round opponent was Vekic, the number 15 seed, and she pushed her aside, 6-2, 6-3. In the second round, it was more of the same against Garcia, winning that one, 6-2, 7-6. Her third round was against Cornet, and again, she won that in straight sets. 6-4, 7-5. The quarterfinal was against Jabur, who was a very tough opponent. But it was no trouble for Azarenka as she wins this one in another straight setter. 7-6, 6-2. And the semi-final against the number 8 seed, Conta, was a tough one. Losing the first set, she eventually came back to win it in 3, 4-6, 6-4, 6-1. So on paper, Azarenka only dropping one set is probably the more informed of the two. But we all know Osaka, at her best, is unbeatable. The keys to the match for Azarenka in this one is she needs to win a lot of first serve points. Her serve was strong against Conta, and it needs to be strong against Osaka. The keys to the match for Osaka is she needs to limit the breakpoint opportunities given to Azarenka. Against Mertens, Osaka gave away 20 21 breakpoint opportunities. She can't afford to do that against Azarenka. My pick for this one is Osaka, but it's going to be in three sets and it's going to be a close one. Let me know down in the comments below what you think the score is going to be and who's going to win the match.